I'm going to do an exercise for American Mahjong using the National Mahjong League card. The purpose of this exercise is to practice reading hands. I call it, what am I playing? If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. Here are hands recreated from a game played at Mahjong time. We are in the end game. There are about five picks left in the wall. It is this player's turn. That's their pick. They need to discard. This is my hand. And then these are the other two players' hands. Based on the exposures and discards, what am I playing? There's only one hand this can be. The third hand down under consecutive run, four, five, six, seven. Based on this exposure, and discards. Can you tell what suit is in the hand? Four, five, six, seven. Pung Pung Kong Kong. This is the third hand down under consecutive run. If you look at discards and exposures, you can narrow down what suit is probably in the player's hand. Because there are six cracks in an exposure up here, it is likely that six, seven, bam, is the other part of this hand. Not only that, but there are seven cracks that have already been discarded. And there are one, two, three, four jokers in exposures right now. So the likelihood is going to be BAMs for the second suit. For American Mahjong, one exposure is not very telling more times than not. Sometimes you can figure it out if you watch their discards. When a player has two exposures, based on other exposures and discards, you can usually figure out what they're playing, even suits in their hand. This is a great skill to have in the end game, especially because that's when discards become more and more risky and you have to decide if you're gonna to play to win or switch to defense. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do, that way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.